Hello friends, our today's lab is regarding the link aggregation in Huawei setup. Here we have uh, two switches, switch A and switch B. In the current scenario, we will use four links to be aggregated between these two switches. Here you can see that we have four links between these two switches. I selected uh, the last four ports of both the switches to be aggregated. Here, port 24 is connected with the 24th port of switch B. 23rd port is connected with the 23rd port of switch B. Similarly, in the 21 and 22nd port of switch A are connected with the 21 and 22nd ports of switch B. We will will create uh, a trunk link between these two switches by combining these four links let's start our configuration first of all we will switch on our topology now we will configure our switch a in this scenario i will configure a vlan 10 on both the switches then i will configure a, 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 a it trunk between these two switches and then i'll make that trunk uh, to act as a trunk port between these two switches let's start you will be hello yes okay let's start our configuration here system view okay first utm system view system name which a first i will configure vlan vlan then now i will configure interface it channel it trunk one i have configured the same scenario in uh, cisco and uh, as well as in h3c setup uh, i will uh, give the links of both those two labs uh, in the description of uh, this video so that you can understand the uh, main theme of this lab uh, in uh, Cisco as well as in H3C and Huawei setup. I have created the ETH trunk which is equivalent to the ETH channel in Cisco ETH trunk. Now I will assign an B LAN 10 to our first interface which is connected with this PC3 and this interface will be uh, will act as an access port interface gigabit 0 slash 0 slash 0 slash 1 port link type access port default VLAN 10 now i will uh, assign the ports to this ether channel or in fact the eth trunk one as i told you that the last port last four ports of this switch are are included in this ether trunk first i'll assign interface gigabit zero slash 0 slash 24 it's trunk 1 interface gigabit 0 slash 0 slash 23 it's trunk 1 interface gigabit 0 slash 0 slash 22 <coughs> slash 21 it's trunk 1 all the four ports have been added to the it's trunk 1 
now i will configure this it trunk one as a trunk link between switch a and switch b interface a trunk one port link type trunk port trunk allow pass vlan 10 then our configuration on switch a is completed save and similarly we will configure our switch b system view host name system name and switch b vlan then interface gigabit zero slash zero slash one port link type yes port access default vlan then interface its trunk one interface gigabit zero slash zero slash twenty four its trunk one quit interface gigabit zero slash zero slash twenty three its trunk one quit interface gigabit zero slash zero slash twenty two its trunk one quit interface gigabit zero slash zero slash twenty one its trunk one interface its trunk one port link type trunk port trunk allow pass vlan 10 configurations on both the switches has been completed now let us assign the ip addresses to our end nodes which are the pcs 192.168.10.1.255.255.255.192.168.10.10 which will be the ip address of our pc or One nine two one six eight ten dot ten two five five two five five two five five one nine two one six eight ten dot one which is the IP address of our PC three. Now let us confirm the connectivity between these two end nodes ping one nine two one six eight ten dot then a current configuration here we have VLAN bash 10. All VLAN is this. Trunk 1. Port link type trunk. Port trunk low pass VLAN 10. Similarly. System display current configuration VLAN 10 
Configuration is fine. What systems are not ping one nine two eight ten dot one? Ten dot ten accessible. Why it is not able to access ping one nine two one six eight ten dot ten one six eight ten dot ten. It is accessible now. This is friend how you can uh, configure the link aggregation between in the two switches uh, by using Huawei devices. Let me show you how you can confirm that your link has been aggregated and display it trunk one as you can see that these four ports are included in the it port it trunk one display it trunk display interface brief here you can also see that its trunk one includes these four interfaces and it is up we can add up to eight links into a single its trunk which is also mentioned here maximum bandwidth affected link number is eight here as at least active link number should be one So friend, if you have any query regarding this lab, you can ask me in uh, comments. Feel free to ask questions because uh, uh, these uh, questions will be helpful, may helpful for our other uh, uh, friends which are following me. Thank you.